In this video, we're going to look at the equation of a line. The equation of a line at GCSE level is given as y equals mx plus c, where m stands for the gradient and c stands for the y-intercept. So, for instance, if you had the line y equals 5x plus 2, that means the gradient of this line would be 5, so that means for every 1 you go across it goes up 5. Uh, watch the video on gradient if you need a bit of more help on the gradient, so watch the video on that as well. And it would cross the y-axis at 2. The graph y equals 2x plus 1 would have a gradient of 2 and it would cross the y-axis at 1. Here's this graph actually. So this is the graph y equals 2x plus 1. So if you, as you notice, it crosses the y-axis, so it crosses the y-axis at 1 here, and it's got a gradient of 2. That means that as you go across 1, it goes up 2. As you go across 1, it goes up 2. So that's the line, and the equation is y equals 2x plus 1, where 2 is the gradient and 1 is the y-intercept. Here's some equations, and we're going to find the gradient and y-intercept for each of them. So if you had y equals 3x minus 1, well because it's y equals mx plus c, and m is the gradient, the gradient for this line would be 3. The y-intercept would be minus 1. If you wanted to write that as a coordinate though, okay, because it crosses at minus 1 there, that means it would be 0 across minus 1 down, so as a coordinate it would be 0 minus 1. Okay, next y equals minus 2x plus 1, so the gradient would be minus 2. The y-intercept would be 1, and the, as a coordinate that would be 0, 1. If it asked you for the coordinate across the y-axis, it would be these. But as a y-intercept, you can just put in minus 1 or 1. Okay, y equals x plus 3. So the gradient, well, this has actually got a 1 in front of it. So it's y equals 1x plus 3. Remember, in algebra, x equals 1x are the same thing. Okay, but ten, you tend to write that one. So the gradient would be 1, okay, 1. And the y-intercept would be 3. And as a coordinate, that would be 0, 3 if you were asked for it as a coordinate. And finally, y equals 4x. The gradient of this line would be 4. And the y-intercept will be, well, it's plus 0 there. So that means it's actually go through, because it's got no number, it'd be plus 0. That means it would go through the origin here. So the y-intercept would be 0, or you could give it as a coordinate 0, 0.